Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in. Hope you're having a great week. Yesterday, Google kicked off the next on-air speaker series, and this was originally slated to be in San Francisco and in person, uh, and it was also in the realm of $1,600 to attend, but now it's going to be a nine-week online digital event that includes keynotes and one-on-one -on -one sessions and breakout sessions, and it's going to be totally free. So I'll throw a link in the description of this video to this page where you can register with your Gmail account. And essentially the topics um, cover everything from productivity and collaboration to security. And as a whole, the whole speaker series is about technology and business and the issues that we're facing in the current age with COVID and ways that Google are leveraging their technology to uh, facilitate that and it should be really interesting and it's free to attend but some slides were released from the productivity section of the uh, on-air series which i think is going to be on july 21st but at any rate these slides reveal that there's going to be a gmail redesign that is going to be set up to compete with slack so in these slides if we scroll down scroll down you'll notice um in these screenshots, which are the smartphone version of the app. Basically, you get access from a single app to your Gmail inbox, um, your Google Meet chat feature. So that'd be like one-on-one -on -one chat with anybody in your team if you use G Suite. And then they're introducing something called rooms, which I have to assume are like channels in Slack. So you can have your direct messages on one page. You can have all of the rooms for specific things on another page. And then integration with Google Meet right in this one app. Um, so their idea is that G Suite will become sort of a one-stop, or I should say the Gmail app as part of G Suite will become a one-stop shop for all of the things you need to communicate with your team internally, which I I'm really interested in because I use G Suite to manage the email and all the backend stuff for digital arts experience. But we've also been Slack users for a really long time. And I'm really curious to see if this whole idea with the rooms and the, and the direct message tab of the Gmail window um, will be a good competitor for Slack. Because if it, if it is, we'll likely um, stop using Slack and just keep it all within the G Suite family. Um, in addition to that, it looks like on the computer, uh, it's going to be the same. So you'll be able to, um, you know, chat side by side with email. So you'll be able to like sort of split your windows to have email and a chat open or email and a video conference open or any of those different things, the rooms, the direct messages, Google Meet or your Gmail all from one window. Um, so this looks really interesting. I'm, um, I'm really curious to see how this works. I don't know when this is going to be officially released, but um, they're going to, uh, as it seems from this article, officially announce this on July 21st as part of this Google Next on-air series. So we're gonna keep an eye on that and I'm more than likely going to tune in on that day and see what they have to say about this and I'll do a, a follow-up video uh, about what I learn. Um, and obviously, by all means, you should register because it's free when normally it would be quite an expensive um, event to attend. So um, this looks really interesting. I'm really excited about it. Um, you know, we'll see how it turns out. And, um, and that's all I've got for you today. So thanks so much for tuning in. As always, hit that subscribe button. I release new tech tips every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 2 p.m. And check out the DAE.com for our full list of online workshops, private lessons, and summer camp. And if you have an idea for a tech tip you'd like to see me create, throw it in the comments and I'll do my best. Thanks and have a great day.